You can save time and money by calibrating your broadcast sprayers and seeders at the beginning of each use. It helps you avoid wasting valuable seed or pesticides. The purpose of calibration is to determine the proper rate of forward speed. For broadcast sprayers, the rate of application is determined by the rate of discharge of the nozzles and the rate of forward speed. A tractor or ATV speedometer is very helpful in maintaining a uniform rate of travel. Here are the necessary steps in calibrating a sprayer. First, measure and record the boom width. Set two stakes at 40 rods apart, which is 660 feet. Fill the sprayer tank with water. Operate the sprayer to be sure the entire supply line up to the shutoff valve is full before refilling the tank and recording the water line on a measuring stick or on the side of the sprayer tank. Drive the sprayer between the stakes at the desired speed and with the sprayer in full operation. The sprayer should be moving at normal constant speed with pressure up and the discharge valve open as the sprayer passes the first stake and closes at the second stake. Record the vehicle speed in miles per hour. Carefully measure the amount of water needed to fill the tank after the test. Before refilling to the same mark, be sure that the sprayer is in the same position as it was for the first filling. Multiply gallons used to refill the tank by 66 and divide by the width sprayed in feet. This number gives you the gallons per acre applied. For example, the herbicide label says to spray at the rate of 10 gallons per acre. You will test a rate of travel of 5 miles per hour with a boom covering a 7-foot width. If one gallon of water was needed to refill the tank after the calibration, then the actual rate of application is determined as follows. 1 gallon times 66 divided by 7 feet equals 9.4 gallons per acre. Since this rate of application is slightly lower than the desired 10 gallons per acre, the necessary forward speed must be less than 5 miles per hour. The test should be repeated using a throttle setting that gives a slightly slower rate of travel. Accurate seeding equipment calibration is essential for applying cover crop seeds. You should calibrate a seeder each time a different type of seed or fertilizer is used and routinely during the season. The following steps can help you calibrate a broadcast seeder. First, determine the desired application rate in pounds per acre. For this demonstration, the seeding rate for the seed we are planting is 10 pounds per acre. Measure enough seed for one-tenth of an acre, which is one pound of seed. Next. Stake out the corners of a one-tenth acre in the area where you want to seed. Set the seeder opening on the desired setting. A seeder manual or the side of a seeder might have a chart with recommended settings and rates. Next, close the seeder opening and put the one pound of seed into the seeder. Choose a safe ground speed at which to travel and maintain that speed during this trial. If you do not have a speedometer, try to maintain the same throttle setting. Begin seeding the one-tenth acre area that was staked out by moving at a steady speed and opening the seeder to the desired setting. Be careful to seed the entire area without too much overlap. Check the amount of seed left in the seeder. If there is seed still in the seeder, you should make adjustments to the tractor or ATV speed or seeder setting and repeat these steps to change your application rate. Knowing how to calibrate your equipment will save you time and money and get the results you need on your land. For more information on broadcast sprayer and seeder calibration, be sure to contact your local extension office or the Missouri Department of Conservation.